Now time for us to talk about our headline business story and that's about the fisheries ministry as the minister of fisheries and aquaculture Nayon Bilijo has charged the fisheries enforcement unit to restore confidence in Ghana's tuna industry after a recent and alleged European Union ban on the export of tuna. The steering committee was, was able to bring personnel together to train them ready for the task. We have the Western unit established in Takuradi and the Eastern unit also established in Tema here. And also the three units to be established on our inland waterways, that is Yeji, Bupe, and then Bando Toko. Under the National Steering Committee, they will monitor control fishing operations within the Ghana fishery waters with modern equipment and controlling units. Personnel of the units will be tasked to clamp down on patrolling, light fishing and the use of unauthorized nets and mesh. I wish to urge the personnel to put in their best in order to meet the expectation of the country and the international community for a sustainable development of the fisheries resources whilst putting at bay, IUU, and other criminal activities which pose a threat to our exclusive economic zone. Ghana's fish production currently stands at 400,000 metric tons, which is likely to increase if negative activities are held in check. All right, so if you think we've done the best of stories already, you should hold on for Joel A. Champon as he comes in to give you all the title heads on the UEFA Champions League. My name is Quick with me. Many thanks for staying with us. Later in the evening, we'll come your way with some more business stories.